hey loves welcome back to my channel so today you guys on my channel i know that i have not brought you guys any videos lately so i wanted to go ahead and take this time to sit down and to create this look for you guys um i'm not sure what i'm gonna call this look yet but i was on my way out the door so i figured that i'll come to you guys and show you guys what i was doing for today as far as my face um I don't know I got like some gold some brown some reds and a little orange up in there too you guys so I don't know what to call it but I was just really feeling this look today so I thought that I would come and share it with you honeys and yes this is a crochet in my head you guys I did not film me doing this it was kind of like a spare of the moment kind of hairstyle um I've been working like crazy so I really haven't had time to sit down to do anything and I do apologize for that I want to say thank you to all my new subscribers that have been coming through showing so much love you guys are like amazing like amazing so all my loves that's been there with me from the beginning thank you guys so much for continuing to support me here on my my channel you guys it is amazing to see so many notifications come through on my phone and I haven't even uploaded a video like notifications are still coming through my phone from like previous videos that I've already uploaded and shared here with you guys so thank you guys so much I cannot thank you guys enough and girl you already know to tell your friends to tell their friends so we all can be friends okay come through support show love hit that bell hit that notification so that you can know when i upload a video thank you guys so so much i'll see you guys in my next video hey love so right here i'm just showing you guys that i'm using my 88 color bh cosmetics palette and i'm just going in with those two colors um i believe it was like a little red and um, a dark red little color and I'm just going to use that as my transition color here I've already went in and applied my foundation and everything so now I'm slightly baking myself here you see me going in with the color brown just to kind of put it in the outer crease to kind of deepen up the crease a little bit to add a little dimension there and I'm going to go ahead and do the same thing on the other eye as well blend 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 blending is key right now you see me taking the la girl pro concealer and the color toffee i'm going to just use that to kind of create a half cut crease i am definitely getting better with my cut crease you guys so bear with me um it's coming together i'm really liking the way my cut creases have been coming out so far so thumbs up for that So just continuing to pack that concealer on there, um, blending it all out to where I want it to actually be with the color that I'm going to place on top. And then next you'll see me go in with the airspun, the Cody airspun, to just set that concealer on the eye so there is no creasing. You want to make sure that you always set the concealer wherever you put concealer at on your face, you guys. You definitely want to make sure that you're setting the concealer. If not, it will crease up on you and you be looking like a fool you be looking like a fool so now I'm going in with that gold color and I'm just packing that on top of my lid there I'm just gonna spread it out into my desire I'm gonna go back in with that blending brush and I'm gonna actually blend a deep brown color into the crease and in that outer V as well kind of blend towards the color to kind of get some of that line of demarcation gone away from you know looking so bold then I started to just switch up with my brushes I was going in with the deep brown back into the red and the orange color and just blending everything together because the key to everything like I always tell you guys is to blend 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 i'm telling you guys this again from my own personal experience you cannot just put stuff on your face and do not blend it you be looking like a fool you be looking like a fool so right now i am going ahead and using this little vanilla color out of that nyx palette to kind of give me a little color to my brow bone and honey 
she slayed this wing liner, honey. Okay, y'all know that I have been struggling with the wing liner. But this particular day, honey, I do not know like God gave me life this day, okay? I feel like I slayed this wing liner. Y'all tell me down in the comment section below what y'all think. But honey, she was ready to cut somebody with that wing liner, okay? Cut them, girl, cut them. <laughs> definitely takes practice practice makes perfect like I, I am not a makeup artist i just do what i love to do and i do what works best for me on my face so you know she plays around and she gets it until she thinks she got it but that cut crease honey look at that that's nice and also that well not the cut crease i didn't mean to say that i'm sorry you guys the wing liner like Girl, get, girl, get your life. You was feeling yourself, honey. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yes. Get it together. Yep. You looking good. So right now I'm going to go in with the Bobbi Brown um, mascara. And I'm just going to put a couple of coats onto that top um, lash. So that my lashes have something to kind of stick to and kind of blend together with the falsies. Then I'm just going through and doing the same thing on the other eye that I did on the last eye. You guys, my bun was giving me so much life. Like, I am really loving this bun. But guess what? She already ready to take her hair down. <laughs> I am so undecided when it comes to my hair. But if you guys like this video, please do not forget to give it a big thumbs up. And thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys in my next video.